Hi guys, welcome to video number 16, adding a legend in ArcMap. In the last video, I showed you how to reclassify an image of an oil spill and make a map of high priority versus low priority for cleanup. In this video, I want to show you how to put a legend into that map. So we'll do two quick things. I'll show you how to add an additional entry to the attribute table, and then I'll show you how to insert a legend into your map. Here we go. So I've got the project already in ArcMap. Uh, this was the map I made. The color red is the highest priority, color green is medium priority, and color blue is lowest priority. Notice these are currently coded by numbers, 0, 1, and 2. Might be nice to actually have those coded by words. So to do that, I need to add a new field into my attribute table. So I'm going to right click, open attribute table, and then I'm going to click here, add field. I'm going to call it priority, and I'm going to make it a text. You could also choose integers if you want the values to be numbers, or integers, I should say. You can choose floating point if you want to use decimal numbers. Um, and I'm going to choose text because I want these to be names. I'm going to limit myself to a, a length of 20 characters in my text string. Then I'm going to hit OK. So now I've got this new field. Importantly, you can only add a field if you're not editing. Okay, that's really important. You can only add a field if you're not editing. So now I'm going to start editing. I'm going to go editor, start editing. This was the only editable layer, so it didn't give me a choice. It just went right to editing this. Remember that the value 0 was going to be low priority. The value 1 was going to be medium priority. And the value 2 was going to be high priority. So once I'm happy with my labels, I'm going to go editor, stop editing, save my edits. So now I've got this additional field with the text labels instead of the numbers. So our next step is going to be actually add this to the legend. So to, to export an image, you know you need to go to Layout View. That's here on this button. It's going to bring us to this screen. So I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Let's, let's say this is the image that I wanted to export. Now to add a legend, I'm simply going to go Insert Legend. OK, and that's going to bring me right to this legend wizard. Uh, first thing to do is decide what items you want in your legend. In this case, we're only going to include the most the visible image, the one that's shown in the map. That's all priority. So I'm going to highlight these, and I'm going to click this to actually move those out of the legend. I'm going to hit Next. And the next choice is going to be the title. I actually don't like to use a title, but you can put whatever title you want. You can adjust the, si the size of the font and the color. Border is important. I like to put a border on. I'll choose a one point. And I'll actually I'll put a background here. Background can be important because uh, you, you want to have your legend item stand out from the image behind it. So I chose white for my background. I'm going to leave this at the default. I'm going to leave the spacing and arrangement at the default as well. I'm going to hit finish. There is my legend. Um, Notice uh, two things. One is that I've got this title on top that's actually the title of the layer. I don't like the way that looks, so I'm going to get rid of that. Or I can actually just go up here and change it. And I can call it Clean Up Priority. Once I've changed it up there, notice it's going to change in the legend as well. Okay, And then here, Value, I'm going to set that to 0 because that's not fun to have that. And that, that, got, that went away in the legend. Finally, notice that the legend is still coded by 0, 1, and 2. Obviously, we'd like to have that coded by the text field that we just made, low, medium, and high priority. So the final step to do that is to right click up here, go to Properties, and then go to Symbology. And then for Value, choose priority instead of the numerical value 
values. <laughs> so I'm going to choose priority here. It's going to show me high, low, medium instead of 0, 1, 2. I'm going to hit OK. And 0, 1, 2 has been changed to high, low, and medium, both in my table of contents and in my key. Uh, I'm, once again, I'm going to make, set priority to nothing. So now I've got a pretty simple legend, clean up priority, high, low, medium. And now I'm ready to export this map, of course, by going to File, Export Map, which you already know how to do. All right, well, thanks for joining us for that video. You now know how to add an entry to an attribute table and insert a legend into a map. Join us for video 17, Introduction to Envy. Thanks very much.